Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye and I am back with the Planet Crafter and I am up on the second floor of my base that I have been expanding on. Got basically little living quarters up here. I'm trying to eventually get to the point where I have a ladder that I can build. It's not available yet. We have stairs. And no ladder yet. That's going to make getting up and down a lot easier once that goes into effect. But for now, I don't know what to think about that. That can't seem to get it to match up there, but it works for now. It's a little weird, but it works. Yeah, I need to get some water because I'm getting a little low here. Let's see. We got plenty of water. And we need a little bit of food. We need to start growing food. And I don't think... I have I got the ability to grow it yet? Yes, I do. I have a food grower. And that is the next thing we're going to work on here. We're going to start growing our own food. That way we're not having to search for it. In chess, I need some water. Might grab another water. I've got plenty of oxygen. And beans seem to give you the most bang for your buck as far as health goes. I need some iron and what else do I need? Let's see. Aluminum. 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 Let's see. Do I have aluminum? thought I did. Let me check. Okay, I do. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's make two of them. That way we will be more certain of growing what we need and plus I think I might grow let's see we got eggplant too well like I said the beans do seem to give you more health so we'll start off with that now we're a place that needs to be very strategically placed because we don't want it we want to be able to expand out I can't put anything out here for some reason. I can't build any structures in this location, so this is actually a good spot to build them. Alright, let's see here. Let's place this one here. And I'm going to try to leave enough space for another one if I decide to build it later. And we just put them in here. They'll start growing. Food. We got another meteor storm. Might be a good idea to take a look, see what's where they're hitting. That one looks like it's coming kind of close. Not as close as I thought. A lot of them are hitting right over there, which is good. That's close. Yeah, let's go take a look at that one. Yeah, a lot of these meteor storms will have aluminum in them. You can tell where they hit. There's a lot of rubble around. See what I mean? I looked a lot closer. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Got some iron. Silicon. I don't see any aluminum. Just iron and silicon. Well, that was already here. Yeah, that's from the, the... Yeah, if they just click, that means it was 
part of the meteor storm. Pretty much all the standard stuff, honestly. Nothing special. No iridium, no uranium, no osmium, no aluminum. Well, I'm going to check over here as well. First, I need to get some... Grab some ice. Yeah, once you get to a certain temperature, the ice disappears. Everything melts. Get our oxygen up. Then we'll go over here and check. Yeah, I like... I mean, I can use my tanks, but I'd rather save them if I can. All of this will be underwater very shortly. We're actually... Reaching 175,000 TI fairly quickly. We're about halfway there. Once the sky gets blue, then it'll start to rain. Well, I do not see where any of those asteroids are at. Those meteorites hit. Let's give me a call them asteroids. Quite a bit of stuff here we can plop in here. I am going to take a little bit of iron with me. Drop this ice off. Magnesium. Drop that off. We'll keep the silicon. I don't have a miscellaneous storage, do I? Food, etc. <laughs> Yeah, we'll, we'll put the cloth in there for now. Let's see, the beans are starting to grow. And pretty soon we are going to have to start coming up with better modes of energy here. Let's see, all we got now... ...are solar panels. wind turbines. That's not going to cut it. Let me go ahead and grab some of this. Because I think I'm going to go check out this other wreck over here. Oh, there's a chest. Cobalt and magnesium. Yeah, always make sure you break the chest down. That way you don't run across the thinking you found something, and in reality, all you found is an empty chest. But right now, the sky is starting to turn blue. It's still purple, but not like it was. Yeah, once I get here, I need to build myself, if I haven't already, a little base. Yeah, I'm playing another game, so sometimes I get them a little bit mixed up. The other one, I'm much, much farther along. But this base, or this wreck here, has a lot of good loot in it. I'm gonna need to get some oxygen here. Need to find a flat enough place to build. And I think it was right up here. No? Where did I find it before? This is not very flat. I 
Oh, I, already, I did put a pod in. I wasn't sure if I did or not yet. All right, we got we got something here. Let's see, we did do a little bit of exploration here, so got quite a bit of stuff. Not sure what I have and haven't gotten yet, but we need to build better storage. Those little blue chests are just not big enough. And we need to build more here, because we are going to spend some time here. This is a good stop-off point. Let's see here. We need iron. Well, there's iron in here. some titanium just to make sure. I think I have food here. I hope I have food here. It'd be bad if I don't have food here. <laughs> there we go. We're gonna make another one if we can. Yeah, I think I'm going to move this. Before I need to build any more, I'm going to go ahead and craft some more oxygen. I'm going to put a T3 oxygen tank on that. What have I got on here? Got a T3, okay. Bye. Right here, this cave will open up soon. And I don't know if you can see the blue back behind there, but that is osmium. It's the first place you're going to see it once this starts to melt. I'm trying to let's see. Let's put the foundation right there. Yeah, it looks better. Build another one of these or not? Let me see here. Yes. Sir. Good. A window there. Make it a little more friendly. <laughs> Let me grab a little more iron. Uh, I think I need titanium. Or yeah, I do. I got some. Some cobalt and some silicon just in case. I can't build that way anymore, but I might build about one behind it. Let me see here. No. No, I'm gonna have to go up. Be able to access it for a while yet either. Alright, let's see. Let's go ahead and empty this out and move it. Let me see here. Storage. I can't go back that way anyway, so it's not going to be a big deal about putting in storage cabinets. blue chip microchip. We'll make some oxygen out of that. 
And we got two oxygen, two water. In fact, let's go ahead and make one more water. Drink some water. And go explore that wreck. I'm daggone near out of food. Yeah, it would be a sad day for me to die of starvation. Yet survive. There is a box up here somewhere. I ran into it. Yeah, here it is. This is a golden chest. You will very rarely find these, and usually they're filled with really cool stuff. We got golden seed, which this is an oxygen multiplier of 600%. An iridium rod, which is going to allow us to build a furnace. Some super alloy and a golden effigy. I don't know what that's for, but something tells me it's going to be very important someday. Let's go ahead and break that down. That breaks down to aluminum and super alloy. So you want to definitely break that down. But yeah, it's up on top of there. I found that in the other playthrough. Thought I'd let you know where it was. But we're going to come in here and see if there's anything else to take out of here. I'm not sure if I've fully clean this out yet or not. Now eventually we can clean some of these other things out too, but we have to be on a tier one deconstruction ship. Whatever that means, but yeah, there are some more chests in here, so... Got aluminum, silicon, iridium, water... Shanga seeds, more cloth, and we are already filled up. Believe it or not, we're going to have to come back. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's another meteor shower or just a dust storm. I think it's just a dust storm. Alright, so we have... Seeds. The golden effigy. We got super alloys. Actually, I think what I'll do is I'll put the minerals in here and keep the oddball things in there. Iridium, uranium, and a uranium rod. Not bad. We got some good good loot out of that. Drop the silicon in here too. It's titanium. We somehow managed to get us some excess water too. So I'm gonna throw one water and one oxygen in here. Actually, one more water. Looks like the storm has passed. And we're going to head back up in here. Now, we haven't found any food. And that's really not good because we have no food sources over here. We may have to grow food here as well. Here's that last chest. We have food here, so that's good. We got some seeds. Also good. Yeah, I might put a food source here too. Just so that I always have some cooking, basically. <laughs> some of these... I think I have checked everywhere back here. I'm not sure. Nope, nothing there. 
Nope, there is a chest here. Nothing in it. Which means we already harvested everything out of it. Let's see. There's one here. Found another microchip. That's great. We've got a microchip box with a microchip in it. That's three so far. We've got a message here from the cargo ship Cirella 4. I'll read that, but we can't really read it right now. It'll be stored in our... It looks like there's nothing in here. Hmm. It's too bad. Sometimes you can find a... Uranium rods in that. I think that's all there is. We have harvested all that we can harvest. Wait a minute, here's some. Got that, but you can't deconstruct that. Let me go ahead and get some oxygen here, because I'm going to run out here. Yeah, I don't think there is anything else we can get. This is pretty much it. Unless there's a secret way in. Yeah, I've been trying to figure out if you put a uranium rod in that... that uh, reactor if it will turn the power on this thing. And maybe it'll open up other areas. I don't know. I haven't found that in the other playthroughs, so... I don't know if it's going to be true for this one or not. Let's see. We've got... Yeah, I want to take the best stuff over there, but let me see if I have the stuff to build a place where I can grow some food here. Yeah, this is why I saved this space right here, so I... What? Why can't I... Okay, there it goes. Alright. What kind of seeds do I have? I have... Just have the one. Looks like we're going to grow squash. Alright, we have food growing here now, so we have two official bases. I'm going to grab the, all the iridium. Ir ir oh, I can't carry the iridium? Hmm. I can leave the Lerma seed here. I want to bring the golden seed. The golden seed is... Got a heck of a multiplier on it. I'm gonna grab that. Yeah, anything that's just regular stuff, I'm gonna leave here. And I'm gonna leave the food here too, just in case. Because I'll be able to get back in time to get food. I'm gonna grab the cloth, I'm gonna grab the effigy. Super alloy. I don't have room for all the uranium other than wait a minute, let's drop that off. Well, I got as much of it as I can carry.
beans are growing. Let's see. expand out even farther. I'm going to have to start putting more storage over here now. Let's see, do I have enough iron to make... Nope, I don't. Grab two more iron. Yeah, I'm going to put all this cloth in there, as well as these rarer items, for now. Eventually, we will have our own spot. Ooh, I think I almost have enough to make a bed now. That's cool. Alright, let's see what kind of microchips we can unlock here. Let's see. T2 Agility Boots, Compass, Recycling Machine, eh, actually not very, not actually very good stuff, I mean, the Agility Boots aren't bad, but, oh, we got beans, there we go, we now can produce our own food. In fact, we'll eat one, I'll show you how much it fills you up. Almost all the way. So that's a good thing. Once you pick them, they just grow right back after so long. I don't know if I can build a bed yet or not. Yeah, I think I can. Let's go ahead and do that. Need one iron. This is just for aesthetics. It really doesn't... You don't use it. 
You can sit down in chairs, but you can't lay down on a bed or sleep through the night. Yeah, I think I'm going to put it in this area here. There we go. We actually have a bedroom. Anytime I get completely filled up, I always try to save the game just to make sure. Now we've got a heater here. Do we have the next level of heater? Not yet. But we might want to go ahead and build another one because... So we got two small ones. One large one. Okay. Titanium, silicon, iron, aluminum. Gotta keep heating this place up. Okay, too much power. We're going to need to bump up our power output. Let's see. I'm going to need solar panels. I need one iron, one magnesium, one silicon, two cobalt and aluminum. Okay. Aluminum, titanium, iron, magnesium, silicon, two cobalt. Oh boy, I have to go out and get that. Don't think I have any. Not at the moment. Let's go get some cobalt. Yeah, we need a better power source. Alright, let's go ahead and see how many of these we can go ahead and build.
Yeah, here's one to hit. getting a standard fare. Two more. I don't know. Let's see. Ain't gonna hurt us to have as many of these as possible. Last thing we need to do is run out of power. Beans are still growing. Yeah, I need to make a little more oxygen too. I mean, where's the... Over here. What do I need to do to make the T2 agility boots? I need... Are oh, you kidding me? Shouldn't have used that cloth. Thank God. Figures. I don't think I have any more either. Nope. Gonna be a minute before we can make more. Former here, we are 65% to blue sky. I think it's auction we're having a, we're the slowest on building at the moment. Pressure we need too. We've only got a couple of plants going. That's a Shanga seed. We did bring back one that's got a better multiplier on it though. Let's see, where do we put that? Yeah, this one goes 600%. That will... Oh. That should help. Let's see, what's this one? It's 200%. That's only 150. So let's put this one in its place. That'll produce more oxygen. here. 
I think I might have a better seed than that. That's 150. That's 200. That's what we want. Pastera seed. Alright, now we got more oxygen going into the atmosphere. Might need more pressure. Yeah, oxygen, as you can see, is definitely going up. As is our terraformation. Yeah, we are going to reach blue skies in no time here. In fact, they're starting to get that way. Yeah, at this point, we need to just pick up some materials. There's another place to explore over there. That is loaded with stuff. But when we go over there, we're going to need to build another base. I like to build little stop-off bases everywhere. We can store some things there. We can put some equipment there. We always have a place to stop. Oh, good. We've got another veggie tube now. The T3. Oh, this looks like this was hit by an asteroid. I mean, a meteorite. is in trouble. Alright, we're going to go ahead and empty this. Shoot. Empty this out. essentials. Water. Auction. See, this is already grown up. We've seen lots of oxygen. Go ahead and make another storage container. You can't have too many of these, I swear to God. Cannot have too many of these. Yeah, I need to start stacking more up here.
There we go. We are making headway on this, guys. We are definitely making headway. We've got huge place now. It's getting bigger and bigger. Can't get up to the top level from here yet, but we will eventually be able to do so. I'm going to go ahead and store this in here for now. Now, the other kind of veggie tube goes outside, so we're going to have to figure that one out. our beans. We are three quarters of the way there, guys, to blue skies. Oh, and we can make a T2 exoskeleton. Let's go ahead and do that and we'll finish off with that. That means we can carry more stuff. So we need aluminum. Oh, I can't remember everything they said. Hold on. Need two magnesium, silicon. It's two magnesium and silicon. existing one that we have. So right now we've got what, four 20 slots? It takes us up to what? Oh, it gave us four more. So now we have 24 slots. Well, that's better than me. A little better. <laughs> Fantastic, but it's a little better. eventually make our mining speeds go up too. And add a compass. That could be useful. To get the compass, we need aluminum, magnesium, two aluminum, magnesium, and silicon. south and east and west availability. What else can we do here? We've got an increase in our mining speeds. Right now I think we just have... We don't have any increases. Always aluminum. Well, I know where to find aluminum, so... Even if we run out, we should be alright. space now. Now we might eventually turn this into more storage. I don't know yet. Might just keep this area down there for storage. What is it going to take to do that last mining increase? It's going to take looking at Super Ally, which we have both of. Might as well max it out here, guys. Let's 
see that automatically goes to that, so you we now have the ability to get them do the mining faster. Let's see just how fast it goes. Oh yeah, much better. You barely have to tap it. Alright. Well until we progress a little bit with our terraforming, I can't really do much more. I have and I'm starting to run out of good power sources. I'm just going to drop off all these ores for now and try to collect some more off screen. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And we will be back with more The Planet Crafter. So until then guys, as I always say, Aim straight, cast far, and have fun. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.